Hello, this is Chris with CricketUsers.com and today we're going to look at the LG Optimus Regard for Cricket Wireless. This is their first 4G LTE handset. Um, originally, Cricket came out with LTE broadband in the Tucson market and then expanded to Las Vegas. Uh, after the announcements of the Regard and the S3, uh, they've really expanded and we've uh, talked about the areas that will be coming to them. So now the current cities that will support are Atlanta City, New Jersey, Austin, Texas, Brownsville, Texas, Corpus Christi, Texas, Del Rio, Texas, Eagle Pass, Texas, Houston, Texas, Killeen, Texas, Laredo, Texas, Las Vegas, Nevada, McAllen, Texas, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, Phoenix, Arizona, Tucson, Arizona, San Antonio, Texas, Temple, Texas, and Wilmington, uh, Delaware. But before I go any further, I'd like to tell you guys, if you are in Houston, please stop by the Galleria location. Uh, it's a cricket corporate store and uh, a lot of good people there. We uh, thank them a lot for helping us out, uh, making it possible for us to review this phone. They are located on the second floor of the Galleria where Borders uh, used to be. So moving right along, um, here's the V8000, the Alcatel Authority, the S3, not the Cricket Wireless version, the Huawei Ascend D, and here is the Regard. So this phone uh, hasn't been activated yet. We asked them if they could please uh, not activate it so that we could show you guys on the internet. So here's the phone. Still has the cover on it. Let's go ahead and take this off. And you can see they do have a micro SIM slot right there. All right, you can see right here the SD card, and it does come with the 4 gig uh, Move Music SD card, 1 gig for our space, and 3 gigs for Move Music. So the app will be able to be downloaded um, really soon, so we'll support Move Music. Uh, right now, uh, it doesn't. Rest assured, there probably are some ways to get Move Music working. Uh, download the APK, for example, uh, off of our website. Let's go ahead and get the SIM card out of the box. Here's the quick start guide. If we look a little bit deeper, we'll find the battery, a travel adapter, and a USB cord. So let's set those accessories aside. Go ahead and open up the battery. I do recommend charging the battery fully before really using the phone. But, of course, let's put in our SIM card. So we were wondering if Cricket was going to use embedded chips like uh, Sprint, but they have decided to go the route like uh, Verizon and go ahead and go for a SIM card. So go ahead and place that in the device. Place the battery in there. Rear cover, you can see there's a flash right there for the camera and a 5 megapixel camera. Uh, you can see the hole for the speaker phone on the back, Cricket 4G LTE. Logo. Capacitive touch buttons at the bottom. Well, let's go ahead and boot this up for the first time. So you can see it is a rather small uh, phone, but it does have a 1700 uh, milliamp hour battery, so that should provide us with some pretty good life. Let's go ahead and click next through the setup. Uh, we won't sign in yet. We'll allow the location settings. So basically in this first video, we're just going to activate the phone. Uh, we'll do speed tests a little bit later. It does have a 1.2 gigahertz uh, processor. It's dual core uh, Qualcomm Snapdragon. You can see the 4G LTE logo right there. Let's go ahead and start 228 the device to activate it. We were informed by the employees there that it still uh, uses this process and that dialer code. For English, please stay on the line. 
This is a 3.5 inch diagonal screen. Supports 16.7 million colors. It's an LCD screen, resolution at 320 by 480. The phone only weighs 4.65 ounces. The radio modes are uh, LTE 1700, 1900 MHz, and CDMA 850, 1700, and 1900 MHz. From the specs that we found, it has 5.6 gigabytes of total internal storage available to the user. Features Android 4.0, ice cream sandwich. Supports up to a 32 gigabyte micro SD. It does have an autofocus, so you should be able to use barcode reader. And it's supposed to support 1080p HD with video editing. One of the other interesting things is that in the Houston market, they are going back to that promotion where if you pay three months up front, you can get the fourth month free. You can see my total here is 20804 for the service. So that will give me the $60 a month plan for four months. So I'll get with the LTE phone. Uh, 5 gigs of data per month. So there you have it. Phone seems to be pretty responsive. Go into our app drawer. Doesn't have any problems moving around. You can sort it out by your downloads and your widgets. You can access the settings really easily. Your toggle button scroll and you can even edit some of them right there. Here's our first text. Thank you for registering with Cricket. So despite the resolution being a little low, the screen actually looks fine. If you want hands-on with this device, visit your nearest Cricut store. And for more videos and comparisons, please like this video, subscribe to this YouTube channel, uh, like our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash Cricut users and become a member of our forum at cricketusers.com. Thank you.